million years ago, life first appeared in the seas of an infant earth. Over 400 million years ago, living creatures left the protective waters to begin life on land. About two million years ago, the earliest man walked upright on the land. 204 years ago, James Watt made improvements to the steam engine and began the age of technology, forever altering the course of man. 66 years ago, two men named Wright again changed the pattern of life on this planet. Today, men first left the protective atmosphere of Earth to walk in the vacuum of the moon. There is no strife, no prejudice, no national conflict in outer space as yet. Its hazards are hostile to us all. Its conquest deserves the best of all mankind. And its opportunity for peaceful cooperation may never come again. But why some say the moon? Why choose this as our goal? And they may well ask, why climb the highest mountain? Why 35 years ago fly the Atlantic? Why does Rice play Texas? I want to tell you, I had the biggest thrill I've ever experienced. I was just waiting for that for a moment, you know. And I thought this was tremendous. This is something that, well, it's so new that we, we don't know the immensity of it. A lot of people think we're wasting a lot of money on this space program. Do you agree with that? Well, I really don't think so. I think you got to look at the long-range factor of it. You know, a lot of people thought we were like wasting a lot of money when we came over across uh, the Mississippi back in 1803. What about you? Would you like a trip to the moon? Oh, it's Mrs. Spade, yes. Uh, I can't see how this is going to aid uh, uh, our plight here in the, in the United States for the poor. Would you like a trip to the moon? Um, no. Expenses paid? I don't care. I don't want a trip to the moon. I want to settle things here on Earth, you know? And I do sure wish them lots of luck and Godspeed that they get back safe. Oh, I think it's really a great event for a man from just our planet, not just the United States, to get on a, be, actually be on another world. I think it's fantastic. The more money they spend on it, the better. Someday you might be going there. Oh, hope not. Why not? I don't think I have the courage. <laughs> I think it takes a lot of courage. You better believe it. We choose to go to the moon. We choose to go to the moon. moon in this decade and do the other things, not because they are easy, but because they are hard.
spacecraft commander Neil Armstrong and command module pilot Michael Collins. That's Shirts you wear 